Welcome everybody to my latest video. And for this video, as you can see, we have the Pandora's Box 4S. Now, my understanding about this one is I think it has an additional 35 games possibly and um maybe it has uh HD resolution output. I'm not quite sure. Uh, from what I read, you can still hook this up to a regular arcade monitor. So, let's take a look. Alright. Now, this one... It's going to go ahead and pimp out this place here. I got from High Score Saves. So, there's the information right there. They have a bunch of different uh, carts available. And if you saw a previous video of mine, uh, you'll remember I got the, was it God of Game or Game of God 901 cart. However, I returned it. The reason being is that cart needs a VGA um, hookup. So it's not compatible with regular arcade monitors. Uh, it needs a HD uh, computer monitor or TV. But let's take a look. All right. And we got a sticker that's kind of stuck. Yep, same thing. Press one player, start, three seconds, select, insert coin, blah, 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 blah. All right. So here is the Pandora's Box 4S. Ooh, look at that. So you got VGA hookup, uh, HDMI, this I assume is for your speakers again, you got your uh, menu button and your volume control. For the most part it looks exactly like the Pandora's Box 4. Of course it's pink, very nice. I very much like that they still kept this feature. Uh, what this does is it allows you to screw it down into your arcade cabinet. And let me show you something. I still have this other God of Game cart. Remember, I bought two. One I returned to this place, High, high Score Saves, and I exchanged it for this. This one I still have. If anybody's interested in it, make me an offer. Uh, make me a decent offer. If you're gonna offer me like 20 bucks for it, I'm not gonna, you know, even respond. Remember, I gotta go to the post office, deal with that crap. But otherwise, I'll just keep it. Now this one, you can screw down right here, hook up your harness, and, it's, and you know, be like a normal arcade PCB. The Game of God, for whatever reason, they decide to hook up or put these little suckers on the top. I don't really like that. Alright, so. Pandora's Box 4 HD Special. Ooh, Home Wireless Synchronizing Sweet, Sweet Support HDMI Output. Huh. That's interesting. You can synchronize a wireless controller now of course I never use a wireless controller for fighting games but it is interesting nonetheless alright looks like it comes in pink and green so there we are you can look right here it looks like the same type of uh, quote-unquote Chinese JAMA that we're all used to. Take a look right there. The system settings look somewhat the same. Yeah, VGA, VJ, ugh, VGA output, HDMI, JAMA, audio, button setting, volume. I just got home right now. Um, it is Friday at 1 p.m. Just got off from work. At our company uh, Christmas party, got my Christmas bonus, a lot more than I expected, which is awesome. Anybody's interested, I'm actually uh, in the aerospace industry. 
a look at that. I'm actually the quality manager for an aerospace company. Okay, you got your uh, I.O. test. Let's take a look right here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, test this in my cabinet. Hopefully, you won't have any issues. Very nice. Bookkeeping. Does anybody really care for bookkeeping? All right, let's see. Product specifications. Let's take a look at this. Can you see it? Let's focus in. System configuration. CPU is an ARM Cortex A8 1.0 gigahertz. I'm really not a computer guy, so I don't know what any of that means. RAM 2 gigs, uh, storage 8 gigs. Video HDMI 2.0. 31, um, was it kilohertz? And 15. Yep, so you can go to a TV, uh, a CRT, and it looks like even a, um, high definition arcade monitor. Very nice. Alright, so. Oh, we got more pages. Oh, no, we don't. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, put this in my arcade cabinet. And uh, we'll see what the menus and everything is like. So just one second. All right. So here we are. I got this uh, Pandora's Box 4S in my cabinet. And we're going to turn it on and see what happens. Sorry for the reflection here. A little cheesy introduction here. Well, there you are. The S stands for special. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the um, the menu settings. Just give me a second here. All right, so we're at the settings menu. Um, right now, you don't hear anything. That's because I had to lower the volume. Uh, there's a, some background music, which previously uh, on the Pandora's Box 4, I originally tried to release the video, and it got flagged. Uh, and it was because of the song that was playing in the background. So, you know, right now I got the volume all the way low. Uh, one thing you'll notice, this game, uh, or this car, it looks like it's, you know, made more for HD widescreen. Uh, if you look on the corners right here, my monitor it kind of just wants to cushion things in a little bit. Uh, it might actually be the monitor. I'm not sure because this isn't exactly the greatest monitor. But compared to my real p games, this HD card, it seems that wants to pin cushion in just a little bit more. And of course, I already tried all the settings and everything. But, you know... This is unfortunately where, well not unfortunately, but this is where I'm going to be doing my uh, Pandora's Box gameplay videos. The cabinet that I had before, uh, I kind of just got bored of it. So I'm looking to sell it. I got a buyer who's already interested. And, you know, long story short, on that cabinet, the monitor went out. Um, I knew it was going to go out. It's been giving me some issues for some time. So rather than you know try and fix up the monitor and you know or or pay someone to fix it if it's beyond, well yeah I would have had to have paid someone to fix it because I tried to fix it and I couldn't get it to go, but like I said I kind of got bored with the mon with the arcade cabinet so I just decided to sell the whole thing, 
and you know, we'll start something new. I'll find a cabinet I like, build it up like I usually do. Just give me something to do. You know, I don't in my one of my videos I was saying I was getting kind of a little bit bored with the hobby, but you know, this'll probably get me back into it, you know, fixing up another cab. So anyways, let's uh, go ahead and take a look at the menu settings here. Um, pretty much it looks the same as the regular uh, Pandora's Box 4. Uh, you got an I.O. test. Man, that curve is really... Uh, we'll see how that affects gameplay. Um, yeah, auto exit mode, start plus coin. Auto exit after three minutes. on off that goes really fast coin settings we'll just do one and oh there you go free play nice see how that turns out exit game mode start plus coin menu let's go with start plus coin because obviously if you do the menu um, I just noticed something Obviously, if you do the menu, uh, you know, you have to go in and push the button. <laughs> Total coins, 17. I don't remember selecting 17. Could be wrong. Select game mode. With coins, any... Hmm. Let's just put with coins. Game settings. Oh, that's where you can get the games. Select which games you want, which games you don't. Bookkeeping. Not really interested in that. I'm not sure anybody who would be, but okay. Save settings and reboot. Factory settings and reboot. So, we'll just save right there. Alright, so. Give me a second, let me turn this on, or turn this off so I can raise the volume again. And then we'll take a look at some of the games. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at uh, some of the games here. For the most part, it should be the same games that's on the Pandora's Box 4, with the exception of 30 additional games. Um, but, you know, we'll just go through here. One thing I do like, which I notice... You got the timer right there. It seems to be stuck on 99, which is really cool. Which means I can take my time in selecting the game. Uh, the Pandora's Box 4, the cart that I had, it gave you 60 seconds to decide which game you wanted. If you didn't decide within that time, whichever game was highlighted, that's the game that would load up. So in order to bypass that, before you got to 0 seconds, you have to put in another coin to restart the timer. But, uh, yeah, let's take a look here. You know, lots of King of Fighters. Uh, wow, look. Let's see. So, it looks like automatically you got a whole bunch of King of Fighters. Some others mixed in. Why Samurai Showdown 5 is in there instead with the other showdowns, I don't know. Lots... Lots more King of Fighters. Never really was a fan of the series. Oh, we got our Metal Slugs. Shock Troopers. Looks like the first part is mostly, mostly Neo Geo stuff. Like the first 50 games. Or more. Alright, Marvel Super Heroes. Uh, Marvel vs. Street Fighter. Look at that. X-Men, X-Men vs. Street Fighter, Street Fighter Alpha, Vampire Hunter, so you got y'all all your good Capcom uh, fighters here. What else we got here? Cadillacs and Dinosaurs, Mobile Gundam, Punisher. I'm pretty sure I saw uh, Shinobi was one of the games that was on here. I'm uh, be interested in that. Golden Axe. Chances are it's still not fixed. Robocop. R Rambo 4. 
<laughs> Look at that. It says Ram. Well, I guess if it was really Rambo Four, it'd be I V. But instead, they put four little. Yeah, weird. Ooh, there we go. Magician Lord. That'll be pretty cool to try out. There we go. There's a Shinobi. Nice. Ooh. Batman. Yeah, I don't have to wait until night time to do any of the gameplay videos. That way we don't get a really bad uh, reflection going on here. What else we got? Oh. Super Mario Brothers. Alright. More. We got a bunch of Metal Slug clones. Alright, we got our Street Fighters. Let's see, we got Hyper Anniversary, uh, Super, Super Turbo, Grandmaster Challenge, it looks like. Let's see. Nice. Uh, World Warrior, Champion Edition, Hyper Fighting, Turbo, Rainbow One, Rainbow Two, Red Wave, uh, The Too Long, I think this is my favorite bootleg. Nice. All the M2 bootlegs. Well, M2, M4, 5, 6, 7. Ooh. We have the original Street Fighter. That should be interesting to play. I'll, I'll get annihilated on that. Let's see if I notice anything else. Wow, look at that. That curve right there. Let's see if I can get this fixed as best as I can. I'm hoping to um, get an HD arcade, like uh, one of the newer Japanese candy cabs. I'm really looking to getting one of those. And if that's the case, when I'm not playing whatever I'm going to play on it, I can put in this cart and use the HD. See how it turns out there. Let's see. Ooh, cotton. I don't think this was on the other one. I don't think this was on the regular Pandora's Box 4. Nice. Definitely going to try that out. What else we got going on here? Let's see. What's Super X? No clue. Super Contra, regular Contra. Cyberlip. Can't remember if that was on the Pandora's Box 4. Blombie car, never heard of that. It looks like just uh, Thrash Rally. Baseball stars. Let's see what else we got here. Tetris. Uh, I'm pretty sure that wasn't on the on the Pandora's box four. Final Tetris. Uh, let's see. What do we have? Tetris Master Two. More, more, plus. Never heard of this game. Chinatown. Wasn't that a movie? Super Pac-Man. Regular Pac-Man. Not really noticing anything else that's jumping out. Ooh, oh, yes, yes, yes. God damn it, where was it? Shadow Dancer. 
Wait, I think I played that one on Pandora's Box 4. Oh well. Marshall Masters. Oh, oh, okay. Well, there you go. It's 680 and 1. So, um, you know what? Let's try just for the heck of it. God damn it, where are they? Here we go. Alright. Let's try some of this. All too familiar uh, loading sound. Try and move this out of the way just a little. Let's see how we go. I've been playing Street Fighter V probably for the last two or three weeks, and a lot of combos of my Grandmaster Challenge are dropping. Well, it seems to be playing pretty good. I mean, if I didn't have the real hardware, it's definitely one of the games I'd be playing time and time again. Controls seem good, sound seems to be pretty good. Alright, so, so far so good, but there you are, there's uh, the introduction of the Pandora's Box 4S. If you have any questions, let me know. Until next time. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over.